Well, today, Republican Party leaders are gathering in Cleveland, Ohio, crafting what will be the next four years of Republican platform. But do they include a huge, beautiful wall? Here with the preview is Chris Kobach, the Secretary of State of my home state of Kansas, and he's also a Republican delegate. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Steve. How are you doing? I'm doing okay. Donald Trump has talked a lot about uh, that big wall and Mexico is going to pay for it. Do we think that that's going to be in the platform? Steve, I'm 99.9% .9 sure that that will be in the platform. Uh, Republicans have generally for many years, going all the way back to when Congress voted on this back in 2006, have been in favor of a wall. And I think you're going to see something in our platform that says a real wall, not a fake wall made of sensors, but a real physical barrier. And uh, that's going to be a, a great contrast to what the Democrats have, because they stand for a, pretty much an open borders policy. But I say I think because the, the platform is an organic process. There's 112 people here in Cleveland mm -hmm. that today and tomorrow can amend it, can change it, and it depends on the vote of those people. Okay, and we should point out, so the platform committee meets today and tomorrow, and then on Thursday, Friday, the rules committee meets, and, you know, that's when the never-Trump uh, never people are going to make their last stand, right? Probably. I think so. Yeah. Let's talk about a couple of things uh, in the platform. This time around, it sounds like there will be some changes made to the uh, language regarding same-sex marriage, uh, punish nations that violate trade pacts. Of course, uh, trade is big with Donald Trump. And Mexico is more of an adversary than a friend. Who, who's pushing these things? Well, you know, different delegates have their own preferences. So uh, I'm, I'm, for example, not pushing any changes to our uh, statements on the issue of, of traditional marriage. But there may be some delegates who try, and uh, we'll have a, a debate about it. Sure. You know, that's the interesting thing. We have a very open process in the Republican Party where the media is there able to watch me and others argue it out. Sure. The Democrats are much more closed about how they decide their positions. Right. Now, Chris, one thing that's different than uh, the uh, last platform debate four years ago is ISIS. Uh, we didn't know about yeah. ISIS four yeah. years ago. Uh, will there be some language in there or some stance on ISIS and getting tough militarily? I believe there probably will be. And that's one of the reasons why we have to revisit our platform every four years. You know, this issue has come up. I mean, obviously, we had terrorism and Islamic fundamentalism that we're dealing with before. But now we have a very specific threat, a very specific enemy. And so I expect you'll see something in the platform about ISIS. Indeed, you may see a lot in the platform about yeah. ISIS. All right. Uh, he's the Secretary of State of Kansas. Chris Kobach, thank you very much. Enjoy your next two weeks in Cleveland. All right. Will do. Thank you. All right.